Wild Pacific salmon have been an integral part of the ecosystems and cultures of the Pacific Rim for millennia. In BC, salmon inhabit thousands of rivers and streams all across the province. Due to their short life cycles and their tremendous genetic diversity, salmon have adapted to a range of different conditions and habitats. Since colonization and accelerating in recent decades, salmon populations have declined dramatically. Wild salmon face an accumulation of impacts that include overfishing, salmon farms, pollution, habitat degradation, and genetic weakening and food competition from hatchery fish. But the single largest impact is human-caused climate change. Oceans are warming and ocean food webs are changing. BC is already experiencing increased flooding and longer and more intense droughts. In some salmon streams, summer water flows are now so low that salmon may not be able to survive. Here's the good news. Salmon are very resilient. They have the capacity to adapt given three conditions. Their genetic diversity is maintained. They have safe access to a variety of healthy habitats. We get as many of them as possible back to their spawning grounds every year. To help salmon survive in our warming world, we need to defend and restore their habitats. Ensure rivers and streams have enough cool water flowing through them for salmon to make it home to spawn. Reduce fishing pressure on struggling populations. Use hatcheries more responsibly. Remove fish farms and their diseases from the paths of young wild salmon. And most importantly, to have salmon in our future, we need to keep fighting for a livable climate.